All right, all right. Hola. Hello. How are we doing out there, mundo? This is Course C, uh, Lesson 7, Lex Lección 7, Creating Art with Code. So vamos a creer arte usando código. Yeah. So aquí pueden ver el video, pero yo no lo voy a mirar. So I'm not going to watch the video. I'm going to gung-ho it. But... If you're at home, I can meet all right? You should watch it. Unless you're watching this video and you're programming, then you could do both. So for this one, let's go over the things all over again. Aquí está el workspace. Here's the workspace. Those blocks, the blocks that we'll be using. The only ones we're allowed to use anyways. Run. We could slide this over and when, it, when we click run, it'll either go really slow like a turtle or tortoise, I mean, or go really fast like a rabbit, a hare, right? Just like the story. Then there's these buttons up here, so if we're still having a hard time reading, right, like maybe most of us. I know when I was a kid, it was hard for me to read. You push the play button. Hi, I'm an artist. You can write code to make me draw almost anything. Play with the blocks in the toolbox to see what they do. Cool. So, para la primera cosa que tenemos que hacer en esta lección es, nomás, podemos, nomás vamos a poner blocks aquí y a ver lo que pasa. That's all they want us to do. Just put blocks, play around, see what happens. So let's do that. I'm gonna go left, right. I'm gonna have it jump. I'm gonna go left. And then go forward again. Let's see what happens. Maybe I wanna put this up here. Or yeah, that way we can set a color. Mm, I like green, so let's go with green. And we'll run it. Where, where'd my person go? Jump off the page, I think. Maybe just jump uh, 20. Because I want you to stay on the page. Hey, there we go. See? All right, done. And that's that's all you have to do for this one. Continue. Because it just wants you to like play around. Like, hey, these are the things that you can do. So for this one, it's uh, it's very important. It's muy importante leer las instrucciones para cada lección for this one, right? Because it's not like the other ones. So what I see, if we look at it, it might be a little hard to make out what it wants us to do. Like, is this a block? It doesn't count. So, but when it was, si pongo un bloque ahí, this doesn't count as a block. So very nice. I want to stay with the green color. So, tenemos que completar la caja. We need to put this monster in a box, yo. Maybe it's dangerous. It's trying to get away. So we're going to go forward, turn right. Remember, it's not your right. It's the artist is right, and then move forward 100. What I've seen happen a lot, lo que he visto yo mucho, is some people get this block, the move forward and the jump forward block confused. Make sure that doesn't happen to you. Can we continue? So make sure you read even the blocks, not only the instructions. So I can already tell, all right, it's just gonna want me to finish and make this block stuff. So I wanna use the repeat block because I see there's a pattern, right? One, two, three, four. It's gonna be move forward and turn. Like that's the pattern. Move forward and turn. One, two, three, four. Mm, I think I got it. So let's try it. Hey, hey. Right? That's the pattern. Let's use the repeat box. Let's use the loops. The yo creo que ya aprendimos. We learned already in previous lesson or two. So let's use it, right? Can I use it here too? Mm, I think I can. But instead of four, it's going to be three. Why three? There's only three sides to a triangle. So we're going to hmm, move forward. And then we're going to turn left. 120, right? Forward. I think that's right. So one, two, three. Boom. Moving on. So while you're watching me do it, the program, you jump ahead and you do something else in another thing, right? That's like that's what I would do. Um, let's see. So now it just wants us to make a block around this tag. So it's for my dog, for your dog. Mm, I hope your dog has a better name than Fluffy. Let's be a little creative with these names. At least it's not a person name. Like I'm not a big fan of when people name pets like Doug or Jorge or stuff like that. Like like why? Give it a give it an animal name. So we're gonna need to go around. So look, started, we're gonna have to change some of the things here. Porque one side is two hundred, another side is a hundred. So aquí, you don't know, 
para empezar voy a poner los bloques. Um, that's all I want to do. And I'm going to have it turn right again, right? Move forward, turn right, move forward, and then turn right. And I want to use the repeat block because there's a pattern, right? That go halfway and then do the other. So, porque vamos a escribir mitad de la programa, por eso va a ser dos. Y aquí tenemos que cambiarlo a 200. So, lo van a tener que escribir ustedes. Right, 200, turn right, 90, 100, turn right. So, that's it. Let's run it. Hey, done. Next. See, drawing and being an artist isn't that hard. Ooh, need an homage. They changed it. It's a diamond now. And you already saw how I did it, right? Ya vieron como lo hice. Um, first, I kind of want to see what's forward. What does forward mean for this person? Oh, I didn't put anything here. Let me move this. I want to see what forward means. Okay, so it's that way. All right, cool. It's a reset. Now I'll put this not there. But if they snap together, se quedan juntos. Move forward, and eso tiene que decir 200. So now it'll go here, and then it's going to turn left 90. So it goes here, turn left 90. So it's four, remember? So four. It's just trying to trick you. The shape is funky. But it's still a square or a diamond. Here we go. Continue. Power and forward. See, lo que estamos haciendo es... Estamos aprendiendo cómo trabaja ángulos, right? We're learning how angles work, and we're also learning um, that how to type and listen to directions and all these kind of cool things. So here we go. Uh, do we want to try it? Let's try it. I've already done this one before. Yo la he hecho ya algunas veces, so lo vamos a continuar. Voy a usar el bloque de repetir, right? So we're going to go here, and then oh, we could just go all the way to here, and then it'll do the other half. So first is move forward. Y aquí dice el, el lado largo es 150, so we have two of those, and then two of four of these that are 75. So forward, we're going to turn right. I don't think it's 90 because it needs to be like 45. That looks right. Turn. So move forward, turn right, 45, move forward. Two. Right, because we're going to go all the way around there. Move forward, and then it's gonna we're going to turn right again. But uh, I think it might be 90, because we're already at a 45. So, yep, that looks about right. And then we'll move forward. Remember, these sides are 75, so I need to change it. So this is 75. If it lets me type. And then this is 75. Cool. And then I need to tell it to turn, right? Because if I don't tell it to turn, it'll just start doing it over here. It'll go way off. So I need to turn, I think, 45. Let's see. Oh, I messed up. Where did I, donde hice el error? It's right here. This needs to be 150. Now let's see if it works. Buyeka. Next. All right, we're almost done. Ya nomás nos tenemos que hacer dos más uh, de estos um, problemas o uh, rompecabezas y ya vamos a terminar. So here we go. Look, now it's just a bigger triangle. Each side is 150. Let's use the repeat block. How many sides does this have? Three. So we're going to do three. Then we're going to move forward 150 pixels. 150. And then we're going to turn left. So move forward, turn left, move forward, turn left, move forward. Boom, that should be done. Let's see. Ya no más nos falta one more. El último. Aquí vamos a estar. Y ojalá podemos terminar en menos de 10 minutos. So here it says, look carefully at the new code. What will happen when you click run? Hmm, so what's going to happen? First it's going to say move forward. So go here, turn left. It's not my left. That person's left is going to go here, a 200 left. They're going to make a square, right? Because it goes one, two, three, four. So it's not going to be a line or a triangle. So it's going to be a square. You could also say, I don't know. 
correct. Y ya estuvo. And that's it. Ya terminamos aquí para la lección 7. And that's it for lesson 7, creating art with code. And this is course B. And I am Mr. Manny. I don't think I introduced myself at the beginning. But if I did, here it is again. See you guys later. Uh, and if you're at, uh, at my school, repping right here, Los Robles, Ronald McNair, and East Palo Alto, I'll see you guys in uh, Zoom when we meet up. Right? Adios.